All right, so today we're going to be working getting a Gantu to uh, Diamond because we got that that event this morning, and I got to take my Gantu all the way to level 32. Um, i done it off stream. I was at work, and I remote played for my PlayStation. But uh, this event, we got all these upgrade parts. So glad they actually listened to, every, listened to their player base and gave us more upgrade parts. Um, yeah, let's just let's start with Gantu. Why not? Want to be a little rusty with Gantu because I haven't used him but once or twice. This see, like I got him to once or twice after I got him to uh, Emerald. Yo, what's going on, everybody? You are, dude, my, Micah. I saw that dude. Congrats on that, buddy. Congrats, man. You've almost got him there, dude. You've been working hard on that Mowgli for a, since the beginning, too. You, you love that Mowgli. What is going on, Charlie, buddy? What's up, bud? This does have hyperdrive, doesn't it? Switching to pursue. Time to bring it all together. Big friends. I've got you. Here we go. I've against the Fuli Liz. Yes. Stop that. Yo, Oliver, what's going on, buddy? Charlie's destroying you in Fortnite. Hey, at least you got that new Harley Quinn skin, right? Or that old Harley Quinn skin, I should say, but at least you got that Harley Quinn skin. We got this. We got this. What do you guys think of the new overlay? Had this made. Same uh, same woman that done Smarties overlay done mine here. What do you guys think? I really like it. I'm honest. New overlay, yes, sir. We got this. Oh, Lilo fell off. Oh, look at that. I took out the Lilos with my Gantu. Sweet. Look at that, baby. Bro, I'm blind. Didn't even notice. Dude, it's all right. Your beast is going to be three stars soon, dude. <sighs> I wish I was better with beast. Beast is not my is not my character. He's just just not my character. S tier, you like the you like the layout, Charlie? Thanks, buddy. I like it quite a bit. You know, it's mine. I can I can play any game under this layout. It's not just one game. So that's what I wanted was something that was uh, I could use for everything. I didn't have to switch if I'm doing Fall Guys or something like that. I, I like I can do. Everything on this layout, and I love it. Emma done, a, done an amazing job on this, and, you know, he's good. Oh, I heard you can buy Figment now, but I've already got him, so I can't see that. But I've heard you can buy him now, which is very interesting. Why does Figment cost that much, though? Um, you just, I mean, if you don't have characters unlocked, you, that's probably what they're all going to cost to unlock them once free-to-play hits. Like, I'd, I'd imagine they're going to be probably 3,000 each. So, I mean, that's just, and that's just unlock them. That's not for upgrades for them either. If you want two-star upgrade, that's another 1,200 unless they raise that as well once free-to-play hits. So right there, you're looking at 4,200 if they don't raise it. 
on top of anything else. You know, if they offer crew member shards and stuff like that, you're going to be paying, the, you know, it's going to be expensive if you don't have this stuff. The good thing for us is well, all of us have been playing since the beginning pretty much, so we have almost everybody unlocked and, you know, pretty good standing. So a lot of us will save a lot of money by playing early access. Come on, Gantu, we got this. Great, 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 great. Thanks, Mulan. Damn it, stupid Mulan, dude. That's a bot, dude. That's what's freaking annoying about it. Yeah, he was stupid bot. The Gantu's gonna be a piece of cake, though. His top speed is insane. Everything else is a little bad, though. But his top speed, he's, he's got the speed. Can I join his mission? Uh, do you have characters that can uh, join me in ranked, Charlie? Like, do you have somebody that you can do uh, emerald, ra uh, emerald races with while I do Gantu? If so, then sure. I'll just add that to my service record. Thank you for the gift on Fortnite. Dude, it was your birthday. How could I not give you a gift, man? Got that Harley Quinn skin. There we go. Level 22. Yeah, Charlie, I don't mind if you join me as long as you can... Uh... Uh, we can try Platinum, Charlie. We can see if, it'll, if you can join. See if we can find races, I should say. I don't mind. Just get on the game and my party's open, so just join me when you can't when you get on. We'll see, Charlie. Is your stitch not... Oh, whoops. Sorry. I have to create another party. I always do that now since they've changed that. When are you going to do Fall Guys? Uh, possibly. I'm going to work on Gantu, then I might switch over. Just and I, Well, i got to do Gantu, and i got to do those events that are out right now. You need the rank 33 and 38 to get the last shard for Mowgli. Dude, Mowgli's actually... Uh, I've seen Mowgli quite a bit in my shop, so you shouldn't have any problem seeing him in your shop. Charlie, you have to join again, buddy. Sorry, I didn't mean to hit. Yo, desync. I just seen you in here, buddy. What's going on, man? How many times I say no streaming to distract me? How many times you got to come in here and tell me that you're distracted because of me when it's your fault you're on your phone in the first place? Yeah, Charlie, we'll try and see if we can get any matches. See, we got some matches. Oh, PJ's in here with the... Oh, he's got a Diamond Lilo. Dude, it's a... Uh, oh. I love that Lilo's getting some love now, but my God, people are really going to be using her a lot, and it kind of worries me. Because I still want to be number one Lilo. Once next season comes, I won't have to worry as much, because everybody's going to be focused on the Aladdin characters, and I'm going to be still focused on getting Lilo to... Uh, I'm going to try to get her to Grand Champ before the end of this season. Because if, if the rumors that Smarty heard are true, and they do a hard reset on, on Ranked, then I'll have to grind her all the way back up to where she's at now, plus get her back, plus get her up there with Grand Champion. I'd like to get her Grand Champion before the end of the season. Angel, screw off, man. I got problems with Gantu. I don't need your ass slowing me down. There we go, there we go, there we go, there we go. Hit them all, hit them all. Hit them all out of my way. I'm going to get you, PJ. There we go. Bad thing about Lilo, you get hit. She's, uh... Recovery's not good on her. 
He hit 140. Dude, nice. Nice, man. Congratulations. You getting there, man. And I kind of hope the rumors are true that Smarty heard that they're going to do a hard reset on, on rank because I would love to grind all these characters back from zero back to where they are now. That would give me so much more to do next season. I'll read everybody else's message in just a second. Let me finish this race up. There we go, baby. All right, let's see. What are we going to do? Fuck okay, I've seen that. Uh, just need rank 33. You guys saw that. I got lucky. I suck at this game, and so it's hard for Emerald for you. It just takes a lot of practice, Charlie. That's really what this game's all about, is just practice and persistence. My shop was lucky this season. Then two, uh, two seasons. Yeah, mine too. Like, I've gotten Lilo to halfway to five star already. I need, uh, I think I'm at 37 out of 85. So I need, what, 45, 48 more shards for Lilo, and I'll have her five star, which I'm super, super excited about. Hopefully I get a lot of lucky shops next season. I basically did all this season, uh, all this season, first rank season, so I have to do it again. Um, the the rumor going around right now that Smarty heard was that uh, they might be redoing, like resetting everybody's ranks for every character back to zero for free to play. Like you won't lose anything for your characters, like their levels or their stats or anything. It's just taking your rank from whatever you're at now back to zero. And I think that's actually a, a, a good a good idea. Just so free-to-play players don't see the leaderboard and think, well, I'll never get there. You know what I mean? It, it'll basically be a free-for-all back again. You know, it'll be just like Season 1 when everybody first started, except we'll, our, all of our characters will still be same level. Our stats will be the same. Our crew members will be the same. It'll just be starting from the beginning on NPR levels. Sorry, Peach. Hey. <laughs> Dude, if Gantu's handling was a, sli a slightly bit better, he would be a force, dude. He would be so strong. But I understand they've got to make him, you know, weaker in most areas because his speed is so crazy. Like, my Gantu's level 32 at 3-star, and he's almost got 7,000 speed, which is insane. Dude, I've missed rank so much. Like, I, I love this. I love doing rank. Come on, come on, come on. Get us there. There we go. Everybody hit it, please. Thank you. I see he's light on. I'm going to catch you. Last thing I do. light there we go thank you these light again for hitting my stuff oh look at that baby first place again I will take it Need license plates for Mogul? Yeah, license plates are the one. Th the, the driver's license are the one thing that sucks getting right now. You're gonna quickly get Jesse to platinum. He'll be back. All right, buddy. I pre-ordered Spider-Man Two, and it could be pre-ordered, which was it, the 125th day mark or something. Nah, dude. Use Jesse. I don't care. Well, I mean, we're still getting matches right now, so as long as we get matches, I don't care, dude. Yeah, license. You got it. Collection level is really where you get you start getting your license, driver's license. Um, that's where I got most of mine. But I'm down to like 25, so I've been saving them for once I get Lilo to uh, level 35, so I can start using her there. I'm I'm not using my driver's license until I can get Lilo up there. Yo, Mr. Optimism, what's going on, buddy? 
What is going on? I hope you're all buckled up. Nice upholstery on this chair. I mean, if they restart your rank, that's more tokens. I don't think they'll be doing that. I think it'll still be the same the way it is now. I think uh, if they do do that hard reset on ranks, it's just going to be levels. Everything you've unlocked to that point is going to be the same. Have you heard that rumor going around, Nate, that there's going to be like a hard reset for ranked when free-to-play comes, like turn, making everybody's characters go back down to zero in uh, in rank mode? You guys, there's a champion. Nice, nice. Bell to diamond, Angel to diamond as well. Dude, Angel's one of my favorite, and so is Bell. Bell's one of my favorite speedsters. Yes, he could be a problem for Gan too. Um, actually, Smarty had had said something in my in my last stream about it, Nate, that he heard that there could be a hard reset coming to ranked when the free to play season starts. Which, like I told everybody, I'm fine with it. Like I'm fine starting over at zero. Like that doesn't bother me in the slightest. It'll actually give me more to do in ranked than just lose a few levels and getting everybody back to where they were to begin with. Yes. Dude, DJ, man. DJ's targeting me now. I've hit him several times the last few races with Gantu. There we go. Use that. I accidentally used a charge one last time. I didn't mean to. We're going straight. Yeah, the one thing I wish you had was better handling. Other than that, I think you're great. Gotcha. Got you, Buzz. Oh, thanks, Charlie. Thanks, buddy. Hit me while I'm already down, man. Uh, this will be the first race we've lost with Gantu. And those Jessies really hit me hard this race. Um, let's see. I doubt that, to be honest. I'll start over for sure because it's easy to get back up to Empire 21 because of the... Uh, yeah, right. But I don't see it happening. I mean, if you think about it, it could be a good thing, especially for the free-to-play aspect of seeing new players... Um, you know, if they see the leaderboard the way it is now, it might intimidate them a bit. Savage line, man. Better if I don't take the number one spot for Lila now. Uh, dude, you ain't taking nothing. You ain't taking nothing, man. That number one spot is mine for sure. My Lilo's already champion, and I plan to try to take her grand champion here this week, so... But I do love seeing all the Lilos everywhere. Oh, great. The worst map for Gantu. Let's do it. So what are the new events I've heard about having today? Um, we got another event for Jess, uh, for Bo Peep, to get more shards for Bo Peep and her epic crew, the uh, the, the lambs, for the sheep. Um, we've got another one for Celia. To get Celia some more, uh, get her and Roz, you know, her shards and Roz's shards. And we've got more trikes and stuff for the Lilo, uh, the Lilo and Stitch characters, which will help out a ton. Yeah, there's three new events today, plus on top of, um, I forgot what I was going to say. I have a headache. I'm sorry. I'm rambling at the moment. I'm not feeling great today, but I'm here. So, yeah, three new events. Help us get any of the Lilo and Stitch characters we don't have to at least 25 to 25. So, it helped me get Gantu to 32 and helped me get Stitch to 27. So, I'm happy. So I'll probably work on getting Stitch champion this week as well since I got Stitch 27 now. Dude, man, these... Please don't hit me, please. Thank you. 
Dude, these stitches, these Stitch and Jesse's dude are crazy. Behind me, yep, I've seen that. Yeah, that was a tough one. Savage life, let's see. Uh, Savage life, you're a beast. We shall see. I have a level six Lilo almost diamond, so I'm I'm gonna walk past <laughs> level six Lilo at almost diamond. That's that's crazy. Dude, that's insane. Level 6 Lilo at Diamond. I had a level 12 Stitch at Diamond. I, I, I got him, I think, to NPR 27, but now he's at... He's at what, level 27? So I can take him to champion easily now. Duty. Yeah, my, my Lilo's up there, though. I got her champ, so... I'm happy with her currently. But I do plan to take... I have a level 6 Stitch. Uh, that would be Savage Life Polly. We shall see. I have my level six Lilo almost at diamond. That's that's insane, dude. I don't think I have you on my friends list, Polly. I had you before, and I think when I had done uh, the big purge on my friends list, I I you were one of the ones I actually I got rid of, and I apologize. But Lilo, dude, Lilo is is definitely broken. Like she is crazy broken right now. You level up your level uh, early level day, so she isn't level six now. Oh, I got you. I got you. Don't expect me to go easy on you. Her surfboard is a time saver, dude. Once that surfboard's maxed out, and you can hit curves at 124 miles an hour, you get such a big lead. That's the crazy thing. You made new drawings, and you sent them to me. Okay, I'll look at them in a little bit. I haven't been on Discord a lot the past few days. It was the last uh, last few days of my vacation, yes. so I was I took some time off of Discord. <laughs> took some time off of everything. I didn't stream the past. I didn't stream Saturday, and I thought about streaming last night. Oh yeah, let me tell you what I did last night because I'm stupid. Um, I last night before I went to bed, I, I took a few hours and I recorded the last five tracks that I needed to make for like the faster roots videos that I've been that I've done. So I could have them all up before free to play. Well, I recorded all of them, and when I went to edit them today, when I was at work, I took my Mac with me, so I could just so I could work on editing them. And I started editing them, and they have no sound, so I get to record all that all that crap over again. And that took me a hour and a half to record all that and get everything the way I wanted it. So I get to do all that again. Which wasn't too hard. You know, it's not terrible an hour and a half to get all that done. But still, it was just, I went to edit it, and it had no sound. And I was like, are you serious? I, I was just, I, I was mad at myself. But now I get to do it again. Layla was very broken, though. She is. Yeah, very broken. And the good thing for me about Lilo is, too, next season, everybody's going to be focused on Genie. I'm still going to be focused on getting Lilo to, uh, hopefully, I would I would love to get the rest of her shards and take her to five-star next season. If I can get lucky again in the shop and get more Lilo shards like I have been lately. Yeah, got you, Paul. Or got you, me, Mario. I feel like this season came and went so fast. Dude, this season flew by. It's crazy. This season has flown by. There we go. 23, baby. Six more gain, two shards. I'll take them. Yeah, this season has flown by so fast. It's it's crazy how fast this season has gone by. This season sucks. Dude, this season's great. I don't know what you're talking about. Besides me getting banned, dude, this season's been amazing. I love this season. Like I like this season more than the past two. KM, not Miles, just saying. Who said KM? Uh, 
Gintron. Then you Lilo is very broken though, Gintron Pip. People, uh, I feel like this season, yep. Uh, I'm happy about it though, because Stitch sucks. Dude, Stitch is a pain in the ass. Dude, I agree. I can't wait to not see Stitch so much. But if Genie's going to be near, uh, you know, similar to Stitch, as in broken wise, like her his ability, if if he is, then it's just going to be a pain in the ass to see a Stitch and a Genie. I mean, it's already a pain to see um, Jesse and Pete in the same lobby, which you don't see that hardly at all now, which is amazing. But Jesse and Pete both setting up obstacles is a pain. If you see more than one Jesse in a race, it's a pain too. But you were so satisfied when you got Figment with the Diamond yesterday. I would love to do that, but at the same time, um, I should have done it the other day when everybody was using Figment, and I didn't because I hate Figment. So now it's going to be a pain to get Figment up there. Because now people are using Lilos, and Lilos can easily take out, take a Figment. Somebody in the next season is definitely going to be working. Oh, it's, there's no doubt. No doubt whatsoever. It seems like season two. Uh, well, no, they had season two had a broken character. The buzz is still broken to this day. His ability is broken, broken as hell. But yeah, every season there's a broken character. Season one was Mike. Season two was Buzz. Buzz is still broken. Mike's the only one they fixed. Stitch is broken this season. His ability is at least. I'm not paying. I'm not focused. I gotta focus. Yeah, it's just there's gonna be a broken character every season. Charlie got disconnected. And if they never nerf Mike, if they never nerf Mike, it would just be all Mike's in lobby still. <laughs> it would be pretty sad though. I mean, Mike was terribly broken. Him making his doors destructible has really helped Mike help, help uh, counter Mike a lot. Because now you can just throw anything at Mike's door pretty much, and it destroys his door. We're gonna lose points this race, but it's all right. It's all right. The lot of you. When is fall, guys? Uh, I don't know. I'm like I said, I'm focusing on this for a few hours. So, all right, let's. Uh, I have a five-star mic. I would have been touching everybody, dude. My mic is one shard away from five-star. He's been that. He's been one shard away for. A few weeks now, I'm just not getting lucky in the in the daily boxes to pull a mic shard, and I don't want to spend my coin in the shop to get a mic star, get a one, get a shard for Mike. So, a mic's 84 out of 85. That's robbery, dude. I'm I've been 84 out of 85 for like three weeks now, and it's it's kind of annoying. This morning, I had a shard, a shop offer for like eight mic shards for 71k, and I was like, nope, nope, not doing that. What's the next thing I can get charged for, Mike? I think uh, Captain Gantu reporting for thirty something. I got everything I need to win right here. Um, shards, thirty three. I could get Mike to thirty three. Actually, that's that's not that e that's not that hard. I just haven't I haven't used Mike this season to be honest. Like I got him to twenty nine one day and I haven't touched him since. You gonna play something else for now? That's fine. Go ahead. I just hate using Mike. Like, I don't like using Mike, and I don't like using Stitch. Because when I see Mike's or Stitches, they just kind of piss me off. Because people don't know how to use anybody. Most players don't know how to use anybody else but the broken characters, and that's kind of annoying. To me personally, I don't like using them just for that reason. Because it kind of pisses me off to see them. <laughs> Mike, not so much now. Like, if I see a Mike now, I'm like, you know, I can beat that Mike easy. <laughs> But it's free shards. It is. I, I might do it before the end of the before the end of the season. Just because if just just in case they do reset everything to zero, it would be a pain to work for hours to get Mike back up there just to get a shard when I can get it now for a lot less time. I would rather go up against the Mike than I would a Steamboat. Steamboat Mickey. 
His mic honestly isn't that bad anymore. I'd rather go up against the mic than I would a stitch any day. I hate seeing stitches. Stitches piss me off. It, like I've been saying this for a while now, but if they would just make Stitch, um, if you could just hit him while he's doing his ability and cancel his ability out, that could fix Stitch's problem. That could that could balance Stitch out so easily. Is just make him hittable when he's doing his ability. Get bots out of ranked already, my god, they're so annoying. If they would bring back season two ranked bots where they weren't aggressive, as aggressive, it, I wouldn't mind, but my god, they're so aggressive, they're just like season one bots again. Get out of here, spawn. It hit me up there, I don't care. There we go. It's just the stitch, it's annoying. I agree. Don't worry, I said that before I'm going to get that blue thing. It makes his ability and make his ability cancel out when you get hit exactly. But now as it stands it's too powerful. Suddenly I can't even find early diamond lobbies anymore, really. Could be where everybody's grinding Lilo right now, PJ. There's a lot of people grinding Lilo right now. And most people will get her to diamond today and then quit using her. <laughs> Don't expect me to go easy on you. I mean, I had my own Lilo at rank 25 at level 10. Yeah. She is a little busted. I'm not going to lie. Once I got her to four star and I put Nani on her, like it's it's insane, dude. Her surfboard is so fast. It's just being able to take tight turns like on this map at 124 miles an hour that gives her such a huge lead. What is Goofy's um, ability? What's its max speed once it's topped out? Do you, does anybody know? Because he has the same ability as Lilo, the whole, like, staying on track, guiding you, whatever. How fast is his when it's popped out? Oh, whoops, I was going the wrong way completely. I am dumb. Yeah, you take that angel. And I'll take Bell's furniture. I'm not, I'm not focused. It's okay. Get me with that. I don't care. Can't drive with the hack ability. But the funny thing is, you barely caught up, so. You're slow as hell. Come on, come on, come on. Give me something good. Give me something good. Oh, that's not what I wanted. Well, we lost more points, but it's all right. Goofy is almost slept on character in the game. Dude, I I know. I sleep on Goofy. Like I I don't like Goofy that much. But I would like to see his uh by tomorrow it should be back to normal with the ranked. Yeah, yeah, it should. It's it's just everybody's using these characters now because they can. But getting once everybody gets them to to diamond, most people quit with them. Um, Goofy is the most slept on character in the game. He literally has the Lilo special and Buzz special. He does, exactly. <clears throat> Only thing that Buzz is different is Buzz shoots you just a tiny bit farther and gives you a little more speed, but other than that, yeah. So I wonder if um, if Goofy's ability, like at its full potential with Power 4, if it's just as fast as Lilo's. Because I don't, I don't have Goofy maxed out, and he's, I think mine's... 
think I'm gonna look. I think mine's level 30, 31, 32. Like, I haven't put a lot into Goofy. Oops. Gorge, I'm just happy to help. Yeah, level 32. And I don't have his epic crew member to find out what it can do at level four, and I don't have him at five stars, so. Um, goof, uh, let's see. It could do the same if you get Goofy's boost star up. Yeah. Boost stat up. Yeah, right. Bear in mind, this is top speed. Oh, PJ, what did you say? Let's see. Bear in mind, this is top speed of basically 6,000. If Goofy had his epic, he would definitely be broken. Well, I'd imagine we'll be able to buy all their epics when the free-to-play hits just because, I mean, why wouldn't we? If, they give, if it makes some money, they'll, they'll release anything. Hope you're all buckled up. What do you think? Who's going to be Golden Pass for next season? Um, If Genie is... If Genie's epic and Jasmine is common then those two will be the golden pass characters and those, those two will be the golden pass characters because they always do a common and an epic and the rares they normally have for events and mid-season mid-season racers or not mid-season but uh golden pass or the go uh, the season go of yeah, season tour sorry i'm trying to focus i'm not thinking what i'm saying 121 at level 45 without crew but his could possibly maybe go a little bit faster than Lilo's. Stop that. Just slightly, but... Interesting. I might have to look more into Goofy next season. Because I really like Lilo's ability, especially around corners. It's extremely good in corners. I love it. Yeah, I ramble when I'm racing and trying to focus. I apologize. Like. See, the one thing, though, I do like about Goofy's ability just a little bit more than Lilo's is when getting hit by it, it doesn't do what Steamboat Mickey's ability does and Lilo's does, where it kind of makes you lose control of your vehicle, and that's really irritating. Like, I hate that. That's one thing I hate about Steamboat Mickey is you can't control your cart. It's, it's just really frustrating. Yo, Departa, what's going on, buddy? Yeah, I'll read everybody's messages after I cross this. Get me another win here with Gan, too. There we go. Aladdin's the first gold trickster for the season. Uh, if y'all are good with Lilo, you are good with Goofy Trust. Uh, yeah, I'm going to really look more into putting more into Goofy next season. Um, let's see. And no for limit and for limited events. Goofy special stuns so much harder than Lilo Surfboard. Yeah. Lilo Surfboard doesn't really stun you, it just makes you lose control of your vehicle for a split second. I like it where I think Goofy's is just better where it just stuns you completely. It's just not as frustrating to go up against. Especially if you like if say you're going up a Steamboat Mickey or Lilo and you're in a corner. And you lose control, it just shoots you straight, and that's just really frustrating, and you can get really far behind with it. But I think uh, Genie will be epic, I think. Um, Jasmine's going to be common, and then Aladdin and Jafar, I think, will be the rare of the season. I think Jafar will probably be a limited event, is what I would imagine. And then uh, Aladdin will be mid-season mid, mid uh, season four character. Is my predictions. And I kind of hate that, but that just seems to be the way they're going. Like, I'm hoping, because I don't see them making Aladdin an event character, I just don't. Like, you know, the movie's called Aladdin, you know, it's, I just don't see them doing that. So I'd say Jafar will be the the event. And I kind of hate that because Jafar's the one I'm looking the mo forward to the most. I want more villains in this game. And I hate when they do the event ones just because it makes them, it makes getting their, their parts harder or their shards harder because we don't get another event for them for normally Surprise. midway through the season. I 
but Jafar is the one I'm looking forward to the most. I just want more. I just want more villains. Because right now we have what three villains in the game? We've got Randall. We've got Gantu, and we have Pete, which most people say he's more of an anti-hero than a villain, but. He was a villain, the old Pete, the way he was, like the Steamboat Pete, was a villain. I'm missing another villain. I think I am, am I? I don't know, we just don't have a lot of villains, and I think we need more. Yeah, I think I Lilo. I think the character, though, that has the best, hit, like, ability is Randall. Like, I, and I love that it's a villain. I was working on some of the best players with Goofy, and trust me, he's no joke. You have to try him. Randall's a villain. Ain't getting too right. That's what I'm saying. We have like two, if you count Pete, three. So like, it's just we need more. They need to make the mid-season racers villains. Is what I the way I see it. If they're not going to give us an all-villain season, they need to make the mid-season racers villains. Next season, I'm going to use my upgrade smart. Yeah. Same. I'm going to really pay attention next season. No, I mean, I mean, it's probably my favorite ability just because of how unique it is. Like, there are other characters don't... Like, most characters have abilities that are similar to others. Randall's is kind of unique. His special... His, like, charge special, I should say, is more... Or not charge, but his uh, build-up to his special is more unique. As in, there's no other player has to build up their special like that and i think that's really cool woody and randall have their more unique abilities in the game compared to everybody else Switching to pursuit mode. well see when i unlock lilo the second week i started saving my parts for lilo once i got stuff for her to upgrade her like the first week i focused on angel because i unlocked her day one and i focused on jumba because i really like jumba's ability most people don't like Jumbo's ability, but I think it's kind of... I like it. I think it's very cool that he targets the person in first. But, uh... Yeah, most people focused on Stitch. I didn't put hardly anything into Stitch. Because where he's epic, I, I know he's going to use a lot more um, upgrade parts. So that's why I didn't focus on him. And it's probably going to be the same for me, whoever's the epic next season, which will probably be Genie. I'm not going to put a lot of into him. I'm not going to put a lot into him until near the end of the season, just so I can make sure I have enough for everybody. Oh, I'm so dumb. Why did I do that? God, I'm dumb. I shouldn't have done that. Yeah, next season I'm gonna more. I'm gonna focus more on the character that I want, like uh, Jafar, and start say and see what he is. If he's the epic, then I'm not going to put a lot of stuff into him until the end of the season. All right, we lost points. Maybe. Yeah. Oh, definitely. Yeah, I'm in last. Is that stupid fucking stitch, dude? Yeah, I'm gonna focus on the the rare and the common before I focus on epics going forward, just because epics take way too many resources. Way too many resources. That's why I focused on... Angel was the one I focused on before anybody else this season because I knew she would take a lot less and nobody had her unlocked yet, so I wanted to really work my way up with her so I didn't have to work on her later. Trust me, so you, if you focus on the epic, you won't regret it. And the pro only problem with that is, though, is just the resources they, they require. That's... Like, the last season, I didn't put a lot into Buzz either for that reason. Like, Buzz, getting Buzz to level 30 happened to me, like, a week and a half ago. I finally got Buzz to level 30 about a week and a half ago. Because I didn't focus on Buzz last season. I got Buzz to Diamond at, like, 23, 24, 25, and that was fine with me. Like, I try to get everybody to Diamond, and then I, I ease back until I can get everybody to Diamond. Then I start working on getting them farther. And they have been broken, but that's that's the issue that I have is I don't want to be one of those people that just use the broken characters all the time. Like, I like seeing the diverse characters. I don't like just seeing a bunch of stitches like it's all we see right now. It's just annoying. 
And I don't, me personally, I don't want to feed into that problem. Like, I hate Stitch. Stitch, I hate so much. I hate going up against him. I hate seeing him in races. I hope they nerf Stitch so bad that nobody uses Stitch again. I hate Stitch. Yeah, I just don't want to feed into the problem that's already here. That, you know, epics are broken and that's any, what anybody wants to use. And it's just annoying. It's rare to see somebody use Sully now, now that there's better brawlers. But Sully was the go-to in Season 1. And Jesse kind of... God, dude, these fucking stitches, man. Jesse's kind of took Sully's place because she's just better. Like, her handling is insane. I love her handling. Of course, I would lose my invincibility as soon as I touch that. BS, dude. Get out of here. Still took fourth place. Bitch. Yo, Emma. What is going on, Emma? Eh, still nothing good in the shop. I am doing great. How are you? Jesse's a demon, but she can't do shit against characters like Jumba. J yeah, exactly. It's uh, Jesse is the most overused brawler, and it, she's kind of annoying. But if you got a character that can cloak or you know go untouchable for her uh, for their abilities, then yeah, they're they're pretty pretty easily she's e easily beaten. But take somebody for like uh, like Lilo for example. She doesn't get cloak a lot, but if her surfboard can go through Jesse's stuff, but Jesse's uh, Jesse's a pain for Lilo. Her ability gives you constant boost. Yeah, everybody hitting her toys. Yeah, it gives you that consistent boost. I don't know. <laughs> Jesse's not that bad, though. Like, I hated going up against Sully in the first season. Sully was a pain in the ass. I think next season there's going to be an event going to end the season like Lilo and Stitch and Woody. Uh, we might get more of those this season, Micah. That ain't over yet. They're trying to blow this season out, and they should for the early access people. Like I wasn't expecting to get this. The uh, your Sully super dude. Sully, can his speed get like almost eight k? Sully's one that I just took to level thirty here recently too. What I've been doing here recently, Polly, is I've been getting, um, I've been trying to take all my characters to their level where they start needing license, uh, the driver's license, and then I'm just stop leveling them up. Jesse's the one I thought about focusing on next, getting her to 37. Just because, you know, I use her every now and then. She's not my favorite to use. Oh my god, dude, all these freaking toys. Of course. So annoying. Angel's good. Like, Angel's, like, she is, like, she's probably my second favorite trickster. But I feel like Gantu has just better, I don't know, Gantu's all around better than Angel, in my opinion. Like, I, I enjoy using Gantu. Angel's okay. I just don't care for tricksters that much, if I'm honest. You're so close to streaming on your on your PC. Yeah, Gantu, I'm liking Gantu a lot right now. 
Like he's his handling's not great, but dude, he's he's a tank. I mean, his top speed is insane right now. And I, if I level him up again, I can take his top speed even higher. Gant, you just don't see a lot of Gantus either. Gantu is is one of those, you know, he's just not one of those very used characters. And I think that's going to be just like uh, Steamboat Pete is now. Steamboat Pete, when he first came out, he was everywhere. Now you don't see Steamboat Pete at all. Top speed characters where you shine. I'm more of a... I'm more of a speedster guy myself. Like, most of the speedsters don't have good speeds, though, which is kind of funny. Speedsters have good handling. If, if a character has good handling, that's all. That's what I love is the handling. I like the handling. Don't expect me to go easy on you. Yeah, I'm more. I like. I like this. I feel like if a character has good handling, and you can really, you can win a lot easier if a character has good handling and less less top speed. If they have both, that's great. But I, I prefer handling. There we go. Knock you out there. And it's kind of weird here lately. I've been using Lilo quite a bit. So switching characters feels funny. Like using somebody like Gantu, it's it's very, very challenging. Because I've just I've been so reliant on Lilo lately. It's kind of nice though in the in the same way, just because it's it's nice getting to use somebody different. Surprise! But Lilo's my girl. And I plan to keep it that way. Come on, Gantu, get your slow ass to going. The map's handling doesn't matter, no. I like the Kawaii maps with like Sully or Gantu. They can be a bit rough. Gantu's ability is so good. I love his ability. I need to use the charge more often when I'm in the front. No, the jungle book map don't you don't really need it. There's not a lot of sharp turns or anything in the jungle book map. Jungle book map. But like the Toy Story maps, they have some decent curves in them. Uh, the Kawaii maps are notorious for sharp angled turns, which I find funny that Gantu sucks on his own map. <laughs> Bye, William. I hope to get Mogul Fest. Dude, Micah, good luck. I hope you get him, buddy. You're going to steal my V-Bucks? Uh, Charlie, I don't have very many V-Bucks. I have like 500 right now, I think. That's all I got. Mogul's bad on his own. Yeah, yeah. I think it's funny when characters are bad at the, at the, the world they come from. Which Gantu wasn't good at what he did in Lilo and Stitch, so that's kind of kind of funny. Like he sucked in the Lilo and Stitch. He was never able to capture any any experiments or Stitch or anybody. And then uh he's bad at driving on his own maps. It's just kind of kind of funny. The sad part is Gantu's handling sucks right now, and I have two Dr. characters Gantu that are maxed out. Duty. For his handling, I gave him top speed David and I gave him Loki and his handling is only 3100. So if I didn't, his handling would only be 1900, which is sad for, for Gantu. I also think it's kind of funny that he's like 20 foot in the cartoon and this and this one angels half his size. It's, it's just funny looking at them side by side. 
Check out your Jumba. Um, Polly, do you know your friend code off the top of your head so I can look you up? <laughs> or, or where are you at on the leaderboards? I can look at you that way too. What character are you maxed out with the most, Polly? I can't find you here. I should be able to. You and I were very close to each other there for a while. There you are. Upper. Yeah, here you go. 34. Let's see. Place for me. You say yo, Jumba? Let's see. Not bad, not bad on Jumba. I think you and I have the same, except maybe I have the ice cream man on Jumba. Let me look and see. Let's make this quick. Where are you, my Jumba? Not guilty. I, I mean, uh, hello. Nope, we got the same crew members. Mine are just. I need to get more for uh, for Cobra. That's. I'm so far from getting Cobra to five star though. Yep, you and I are both same four crew members. I need to work on getting Jumbo to champion before the end of the season, too. Yeah, dude, and when I use Jumbo, I feel like his handling's bad, but using Gantu, dude, Jumbo feels like a cakewalk right now. Jesus, dude, Jumbo's handling's way better than Gantu here. But Gantu's top speed is broken. At least Ganto has something. They need to give Figma something like this. <laughs> yep, same. That's what I gave the jumble was all handling. <laughs> I've had a few Gantu shop off shard offers in my shop, and I should have bought them when I had the chance. Because I feel like if I could give Gantu one more handling crew member right now, he You're I could really fly through this with Gantu. Lukey's a must, yeah. Lukey and David are a must. Lukey, uh, David is what I have on all my all my characters for that top speed and that handling. David is the best crew member in this <laughs> in this season by far. He gives the two things that I want the most in characters: handling and top speed. I switch out crew to give him more top speed to be honest. To Jumbo. Yes. See the good thing about Jumbo though is his top speed is not bad. He has decent top speed to start out with, but he's he doesn't compare to Gantu here. But yeah, that's why I gave Jumbo that's one reason why, like I said, I give every character I have to David, because he gives that top speed and handling. <laughs> But handling is something Jumba and Gantu desperately need. Lilo, Stitch, and Angel are good on handling, but Jumba and Jumba and uh, Gantu desperately need it. Right, there's another win with old Gantu here. Wait. Almost got him to 25. Where are we at on coin wise? Oh, I can open another box. Let's see if I can get anything good. Give me a Lilo outfit. Give me the green and white Lilo outfit. Come on. All right. Well, I already got that. <laughs> Damn it. <laughs> no, thousand coins. See, there's the outfit I want. But it won't give it to me. Oh, hey. When did I get one of these? When did I get two of these? When did I get two of those? Ooh, I'll take a Lumiere. Come on, give me a, oh, I was gonna say give me a mic shard, but you know. Mrs. Flint. Two Jesse and two Buzz. Alright, I'll take them. I'll take them. I didn't know I had two of those, to be honest. I add you if I can't. Yeah, I can add you. I mean, what's one more going to hurt, you know? Go down to me. Let's go up to you. 
There you go. Yeah, when did I get those two things? I, did I? Get, did we get any for the season? Did I maybe get them there? I haven't done anything else to get them. I haven't went up in collection level in a while. I don't know when I got those, but hey, I'll take them. Got that Lumiere shard. I'd love to unlock Lumiere. Might make Beast a little bit more usable. Beast is probably me, probably my least favorite character in this game. Well, besides Figment. Beast is probably second. Second least favorite. Don't expect me to go easy on you. Don't expect me to go easy on you. Hey, Tom Tom, I see you. Let's do this. Pigman's the only character you haven't diamond. After I get Jumba here to diamond, same. Or Jumba, Gantu here to diamond. Same. I haven't got Pigman to diamond yet either. Take that. Lilo. I need to work on Figment to get him to Diamond before the end of the season, but my god, I hate using Figment. I hate Figment with a passion. And there we go. Another win with the old Gantu here. Another resounding success. Dude, he just has nothing going for him. His stats are garbage. Figment needs needs something, like a big bump somewhere. They need to give him something to him. Something that's worth anything for Figment. Poor Figment, dude. He's he's got zero love in this game. You should have got that Gantu car at which one? one I have? What do I have? I don't even know what I have. Oh, oh this one? Sign. Yeah. I think I got that out of the box. Uh, no, I didn't get those. Maybe I might have got those out of the boxes, out of the multiplayer boxes. I don't remember if I bought it or got it out of the boxes, to be completely honest. I think I got it out of the boxes early season. Though. Like, early on in the season, I was like, you know, I don't like Gantu that much. Starting out, I didn't like him, but, but I got a wrap for him, I think. I was like, you know what? We'll put that on there. I really want... Uh, I have Lilo. Which one was it? I really want for Lilo. I want a race. I, um, I want this one for Lilo. Yeah, the Hollow Auto Body Adventure. Dude, I love this card. I love this card library. And it would go so well with the red and yellow suit. I really want that one a lot. They love giving you stupid ass duplicates. That's what I've that's all I've been getting lately are duplicates in my box. Never saw that car up, dude. I love that car up. It's like that rocket ship her and Stitch got in at that grocery store or whatever it was in the first movie. I love that. That wrap, it goes so well with that yellow and red suit. But there's no way to get it currently, according to according to the game. It says it's not available currently, so. Who knows? They'll probably put it in the shop one day. Or add it to the multiplayer box next season, but currently there's no way to get it. You really want those Pizza Planet wraps last season? I bought all those. As soon as the season hit, I was like, you know what? I don't care. I'm buying them. And I bought them all for the for all four characters. I bought all four of them because I like them so much. We got Chiku in here. Yeah, I hit Chiku. Always good to hit Lilo early. Takes her a second to catch back up. Charged. Oh. 
on game two. Come on, game two. Oh, okay. Okay, come on, come on, come on. I can beat Chiku. I beat his Stitch with my Lilo the other day. I can beat his Lilo with my Gantu. All right, maybe not. He's ahead of me again. Use that. Yes, yeah, his Lilo. I think he's got me. Maybe not. Hey, yeah, he got me. Damn. Almost got him. You didn't get any? Yeah, I bought them all last season. For all of them, because they were in the shop when the when the shop first went up in the season. I bought them all. I don't have it on Bo Peep because I like her pink suit with her pink car, but yeah. Well, see, the only one, the one I want, I want all the skins, the Pizza Planet skins for the characters, and the only one that I unlocked that skin for was Jesse. I feel especially motivated today. And I hate it, honestly, because I really wanted it for Woody. Woody's my favorite uh, Toy Story character. My favorite Disney character in general, but I really want it for Woody. But I don't have it yet. Jesse's the only one I got it for. That's another reason why I kind of want to level Jesse up more, just so I can use her more, because I have both the Pizza Planet cart library and the outfit. All right, I got to reset the game.